Let's get down to Dick out. Thanks, I know. Jack, I mean, the emotions at the end uh, tell a story, but she was pretty hard fought, I mean, all day behind on the scoreboard. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we had to dig deep in that last quarter. Uh, you know, the boys stayed really composed in that last quarter. We, know, we knew we were coming. We knew we, uh, you know, we were a bit off in the first three quarters, but we knew if we kept sticking to what we wanted to achieve, it ended up happening. And, you know, Hose kicks, what, three in the last quarter, and we get, and we get it going. So, credit to the boys for sticking into it. It's a style of play we haven't seen from Melbourne for a while. I mean, sometimes too defensive, but the balance was right. You stuck to it, you get the reward. Yeah, you know, credit to GWS, their defensive stuff was incredible. And, you know, we really struggled to move the footy for the first three quarters. And it wasn't until the last quarter we really broke out, started to move the ball we wanted, how we wanted to, and uh, got the win. You know how big a stage it is. Round one here, you've got your home crowd. The young man of Clayton Oliver comes into the midfield, makes an impact. Pretty special, isn't it? Oh, he played really well today. I couldn't be prouder of the, of the young kid. He's a terrific fella, and uh, he's in for a big, big career. Looks like you're going in the right direction. We hear about is Ruzi in charge, Goody. I mean, it's a collective group going in the right direction. Absolutely. The playing group's driving it. You know, we are, that's something Ruzi preaches to us all the time. We're control, the players are in you know, control of the football club in the direction we want to head. So, you know, credit to the boys. I really dug deep today and, and showed what we're capable of. Capable of. Go and enjoy it, Jack. Thanks, Dicko. Cheers. Right up, mate. Dicko again has got uh, one of the victors. Thanks, Jared. Uh, Jesse, I mean, you had a bit of a battle yourself with Phil all day, but you only need the last quarter to open up a little bit, get some isolation and get some reward. Yeah, obviously it's a bit of a funny game. You know, first quarter we came out, we kicked five or six in the first, and then, uh, you know, I don't think we kicked, I think we kicked one over the next two quarters, but uh, yeah, um, I don't know, Phil, Phil probably killed me in the first half, and I think he took five intercept marks, and I was really flat, I just couldn't get the read of the game, but um, yeah, I think that's the, the team's belief now, is we're always in it, you know, they look like they were running away with it, 20 points up and had all the momentum, but, you know, we got the belief now as a team that we can, you know, run, run down teams that are, you know, a bit on a roll, so that's what we've been working on, and we're slowly improving on it. You'd start the game well, both of you down forward, Jack and yourself, I mean, in the last quarter, that's what Melbourne supporters want to see, I mean, Jack High, you deep, obviously a good synergy. Yeah, like I said, you know, our forward line, this, more so these years, we've got more of a set on our team. We're not chopping and changing where Watson might have gone back in midfield. I think we're getting more of a set in our forward line. And, you know, I think the, the more we play together, the more chemistry we'll get. And um, hopefully, you know, as we keep progressing, we can keep getting better and better. We can keep just reading each other in the way we play. Go and enjoy it, Jesse. Cheers. Thanks, mate. Well done. Speaking of kids, he's a pretty special one with Dicko. Thanks, Ado. I mean, Clayton, you can't get the smile off your face. Tell us how important this is for you, first game, but to have a win like you have. Yeah, no, it's just incredible. Like, all summer I've been working, working for this, and we really came back to the last quarter. And it's just oh, it's insane. I can't believe it. What's it like? You ran on. The Melbourne supporters gave you a big uh, cheer, and you get straight into the play. Good feeling? Yeah, it was, yeah, it was really good. Just everyone's, everyone got around us. All the first year, that's it. Oh. I don't know what to say. <laughs> He's pretty excited. I asked him, boys, how many tickets he got for family, cousins, friends. I think it was about a thousand, wasn't there? That whole section you were pointing to. Yeah, roughly about a thousand, probably five thousand up there. <laughs> Insane. Now, Ruzi's come in. He's given the young guys a bit of license. I mean, you're a first year player. Um, what, so, what did he say to you before the game coming into your first one? Just pretty much just, well, Maka told me to see ball, get ball, just, just go hard the ball and win it, and yeah, that's it. Struggled to wipe that smile off your face, right? Yeah, nah. I'm that happy. <laughs> <laughs> Go and enjoy it. Thanks, mate.